faster sales. Well, if you've been in real estate for as long as I have, or even five years, maybe two years, one year, it doesn't matter. We've all met those sellers. I'm not in a rush to sell. We've heard these words. Those are not the words that any real estate broker wants to hear. Why not? Because we're in sales. We want to sell. Nobody wants to hear that. Please take your time. I'm not in a rush to sell. And I don't need to sell. We've all heard it. Well, I have a very, very simple approach to this type of scenario. And I ask a very basic question. This is the question that I do ask. And the question is, I know you're not in a rush to sell, but can you tell me, do you really want to sell? Yes. Well, we off to a good start. But the moment someone tells me they don't really want to sell, they're just testing the market. Well, with a lot of love in my heart, and I'm probably going to get a bit of flack for what I'm about to say, but bring that on, I'd love to comment on your flack. This is what I said. I'm not going to test the market at my expense. If you're going to pay me for my advertising, pay me for my time, I'm more than happy to test the market with you. And I say that to people that I can clearly see has now the tension of selling. I want to work with willing and able buyers. I want to work with willing and able sellers. That's what I want to do. I want to work with a seller that's willing to accept the highest, best possible price at a certain time in the market. That's what I want to work with. I don't want to work with people that's testing the market, don't really want to sell, and on top of it, at my expense. It ain't going to happen. But there is something called fast sales. And 90% of people actually wants to sell and fast. So the reality is, how do you do a fast sale? Well, first and foremost, you have to work on the instructions of your client. Because to one client, fast might be now. Nah. To another client, fast might be 60 days or 90 days. You've got to work within the mitigating circumstances of your specific client. But be sure that you are able to take instructions correctly, market correctly, price correctly, showcase correctly, and then obviously negotiate your offer correctly in order to meet the required timeline that your client has set up to which you agreed. That in your client's books will be fast. Someone said to me once, Gary, what's the fastest you've ever sold a property? The fastest sale I've ever done was in 30 minutes from listing to sold. It was a property that I listed. I drove to the buyer because I had the buyer already lined up, loaded them in my car, drove back. They walked into the house, ticked all the boxes. They signed on the spot. 30 minutes from list to sold. Done and dusted off to the attorneys. So we can do it. I've done the 30 minutes. But I've also done for 14 years sale. But you have to speak to your client and find out from them what would be fast to you. Because at the end of the day, they are your employer. They are your client. They are the ones that pays you check. And it's imperative and important that you meet their requirements. So fast to the one person might be a minute. To the other, it might be 12 months. Please like, comment, and share. I'd love to hear back from you. My name is Gary Phelps. This is the Icon Property Group Property Talk Show. See you next time.